Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Lisette. Today I'm going to do a reading for the month of April. This is going to be what blessings are coming toward you. Um, this is a general reading, so not everything will resonate with you. So take what fits and leave the rest. You can also feel free to check your other signs in your chart. And if anything on my channel resonates with you and you like it, please like, share, and subscribe. Okay. All right. So I already um, pulled some of your cards. Your first card is positive movement forward. Material and spiritual prosperity. <clears throat> Foundation and achievements. Truth. Power. And under power you have trapped in fear, movement, choices, and decisions. Okay. So, let's see. I think what we have here is, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I do believe you gained some clarity about a situation that you were trying to make a decision about okay you found out all the information that you needed to know and you decided to move forward to take one of these options here i think with all of these options all of these you know what you're getting into except for this here i don't know why i'm getting that but i think that's one of the reasons why you were kind of it seems that you were indecisive you were trapped in fear overwhelmed about making a decision okay however I do believe like I said you got clarity the clarity that you need to make a decision and make a move okay And I think one of the reasons why this was so stressful for you was because this decision that you you making uh, really is going to affect the rest of your life or your future. In other words, it can make or break you. All right, let's see here. All right, so there is going to be positive movement forward, um, material and spiritual prosperity. Whatever that decision you made, it uh, thrusted you in the right direction to where your foundation, your home, your home life, your happiness is stable. You feel accomplished. You said you did exactly what you set out to do. Now you're standing in your power. You took authority over this situation. You took authority over your life and did what you need to do to elevate yourself. All right, let's see. Clarify positive movement. Holy Spirit, ancestors, and spirit guides. What blessings are coming for Aquarius? I want to say, for some reason, for some of you, you may have had to stand firm, put your foot down about certain things. I know I'm getting that. Yeah, there was something that had you feeling um, bound, overwhelmed, stressed. And like I said, with this power card, you pretty much took authority over the situation and took control of your life and said no more. I'm moving forward from this. Mm -hmm. You're defending what's yours, defending yourself, defending your principles. What I'm not going to do is whatever, you know, that's the type of attitude that you have now. Why is this material and spiritual prosperity here? It looks like there may have been some deception in the past regarding possibly 
some money. Um, this person probably could have been so-called an energy vampire that um, they pretty much just suck the life and joy out of you. You know, this person had nothing really good for you, you know. It's like if they had something good for you, you know, they had to get something in return. You see, he's walking off with these swords. He's leaving something behind, but he's taking the majority. There's probably a lot of drama here. So you had to, you know, probably cut this person off or get these people away from you. Now, one thing I can say is, uh, let's see, I'm sorry that goes here, let me see, I hope none of you guys are doing nothing sneaky or shady, but that's not what I'm getting, I'm getting that somebody else was literally a leech, and with this positive movement forward, you're moving on with, without this person. And without this person in your life, with this attachment, you feel more free. You're, you don't have that, that drain on you financially or um, spiritually, emotionally either. All right, so you clarified the um, foundation and achievements with the Seven of Pentacles. So you are investing in yourself. You're investing in your family, whatever your foundation is. And now that you've recognized this person that you're dealing with, this deception, you can hold on to some of your money. So you're investing in you, in your family, what matters to you. Mm-hmm. There's drama with this person. See? Conflict. There may be some competition. You walking away from this. Leaving this behind. Confirm. Leaving it behind. There may be things that you don't know. There's a lot of love there, but guess what? What's love got to do with it? I got to go. Why? Because you're breaking my heart. Yeah. Too much drama. You know what I'm saying? So you got to move forward from that. Yeah. And that's what you did. And once you move forward from that, or you will be moving forward from that, you will see how your life will change. You know? You can invest in yourself. All right, let's see. Why is truth here? Alright. So right now, I honestly think you're just gaining clarity on this situation. Finding out the information that you need to find out. You're using discernment. You're probably praying about it. Meditating on it. Doing whatever it is that you need to do. Asking your ancestors to give you, you know, insight on it. But whatever it is, you're not moving on it yet. You're just contemplating Finding out what you need to know. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, you need to heal from this situation. And I do believe that's what you're doing along with this truth as well. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yep, look, there's some toxics. Toxic, toxic, toxicity. There's some toxicity in here. Unequal give and take. You got a leech. Look. This is what you're dealing with. This also fell under truth. So this is your truth. This is what you're dealing with. This energy vampire here that just wants to suck you dry. Literally take, 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 take. What you need to do is come out of this right here because you have clarity. If you haven't already, you will be soon. You have the information that you need. You already know what you're working with. You know what they bring into you. Conflict. All right. 
right, so let's see. Clear black power. Because you're walking away. Like I said. <coughs> you are the authority figure. You're putting an end to this. <laughs> Focusing on your nine of cups. Mm. There's going to be some more decisions coming. Because guess what? I think this person is coming back. Why do I say that? Because you got the six of cups. Mm -mm. This person doesn't want to let you get away. You're the money pot. Mm. And then whatever offer that they're trying to bring you is not genuine. You got the ace of... What was that? The Ace of Pentacles in reverse. So, in other words, it's going to be the same. Same old, same old. Same thing. It was before if you let this person back in. And you already know it. You know it. So, um, yeah. Let's see. I'm sorry. I kind of got stuck yeah you're gonna be moving forward traveling away from this look at this mm -hmm. literally traveling away from this what's the blessing what more, what more, what more information can you give me about the blessing I don't want the drama I, I know why does why does a drama have to come up okay so you have the lovers, the king of cups, you got no love coming in, you got the wheel, the ace of swords, and the eight of wands, okay, so you're going to have messages coming in real soon, so I think you're going to have old, the past person and the new person coming in you got the old person coming in with the same old same old and then you got somebody else that actually wants to offer you a genuine relationship however i think you might be a little um i won't say on guard but you're going to be ready to off with their head you know at any wrong moment just you know just usah. you know there is going to be change forward movements you got the world and the wheel of fortune so there's a cycle ending and then there's forward movement okay so the forward movement is probably gonna propel you back up here to this positive movement forward card so yeah you probably have to go through all of this crap here and then get to the positive movement forward material you know you got to get rid of this person out of your life period walk away from it it's gonna hurt but don't cry over spilt milk it's for your higher but your uh, highest good you gotta make a decision look make a decision heal from it balance yourself out yep there is no commitment here no loyalty Mm -hmm. You better work towards your own happiness. Mm -hmm. I guess. So anyway, uh, let's move on from there. Uh, I think I'm going to do a monology for this one. Yeah. All right, let's see. Holy Spirit. Messages, blessings for Aquarius. This sounds like, you know what, I'm kind of thinking, I did a reading for Aquarius about a month ago where some of this stuff had kind of played out before, and I think Aquarius, you finally made up your mind that, yeah, this is done. This is done. You got the information, all the information that you need. Now it's just time to put it in motion. Alright, so let's see. 
All right, it says work through your fears, new moon in Scorpio, meditate and contemplate. Mm, what did I say? Up there with the truth card, meditate, pray, do whatever you have to do. But you got to fix this situation because that energy that you're working with means you're no good. Conclusions are within reach. Yes, they are. It's all up to you what you want. Okay. All right. Well, Aquarius, that's what I have for you. And, um, yeah, I know that you'll work this out. Just um, keep in mind who you're working with, you know, and what does this energy want for you? All right, my loves, you take care. And thank you for um, stopping by my channel. And, uh, yeah, bye.